Joe Thomas joins us now. <laughs> so, Joe, I saw the trailer over the weekend. Yeah, yeah. Um, it looks really funny. Oh, thank you very much. A bit much. naughty. Yeah, so, we're it's... reminding ourselves it is breakfast television. What yeah. can you tell us about the festival? Uh, it's um, <laughs> it's a comedy set at a music festival. Um, <laughs> I guess festivals are quite a natural kind of breeding ground for comedy. Yeah. You play Nick, your character yeah, is called yeah. Nick, and he's just broken up with his girlfriend. That's right, yeah. Played by your real life fiance. Yes, of absolutely, the yeah, Anna. nice and simple. Initially, he's hung up and he doesn't want to join in and he thinks it's terrible. And then, uh, sort of towards the end, he kind of lets go. And it's kind of about committing and sort of just, yeah just committing to the moment and just enjoying yourself. Enjoying basically. life. Yeah. You filmed some of, of the scenes at Leeds Festival. We did, yeah, we you? filmed at Leeds, which which was great. Which yeah. involved you getting up on stage I got and on stage. the audience to take part. Yeah, I did. I was which like, is I, a daunting thing. It's task. a horrible thing. It's like, I've been at festivals and you're waiting for your favourite band and then some little chump toddles on. He's like, hello, I know you're all excited, but uh, who wants to play a little game? And I, it was literally, I had to get them to do like, yeah. And I was like, they're just going to, they're definitely going to hate this. <laughs> And they were weirdly nice. I don't know. I was like, uh, I was almost slightly well. disappointed. I was like, why are you, why are you not kicking off more? But they were amazing. We had to get into like hand movements and like sort of just stuff we needed for these big wide shots. And it was lovely. They're incredible. I was really like busting afterwards. I basically thought I'd performed. I was like, I'm in a band. I've got one song. <laughs> and it's me asking them to do stuff. And it's just All a, ten seconds it's of a your slow appearance. rap. <laughs> it's, um, it's just a long prose poem. <laughs> and yeah, it was, it was great, yeah. That was the scariest moment of the whole film. That, that, the really, whole yeah, thing. Yeah. But you, you say working alongside Hannah, which of <clears> course <throat> we saw you both together on yeah, screen in yeah. Betweeners. Um, it must have been a very natural, easy thing, as you say. You yeah. Know, you get, that, that'll work. <laughs> yeah, it's like, yeah, it's fine. Um, yeah, it's quite, I was like, I've just got used to the idea of just in everything. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> like, just my brain is so simple. I was like, yep, there she is, yep. Um, and uh, yeah, no, it was, uh, it was, it was, it was, yeah, it worked very well, I think. I read somewhere that you once described um, <clears> every day of life where you just want to try and impress her every day and yeah. I thought that's oh, a really that's good nice. foundation yeah, for marriage just to tell you. <laughs> yeah that sounds like exactly the right attitude yeah I'm you working for quite far. yeah <laughs> yeah I'm starting for quite a low base so I'm constantly re re reaching for the stars to um, <laughs> achieve something yeah, yeah but it yeah. is it's a lovely relationship to be able to do so, but do you switch yeah. off when you go home though or do you carry on talking about work or is um, it something that you can box away I don't know I think it's uh, it's I, I don't know. I suppose I, I guess I do try and just switch off when I get home. Yeah, I, I, it's uh, if you're doing comedy all day, sometimes you just want to be calm and yeah. sort of like <laughs> chilled. I don't know. I'm trying to introduce the word chilled into my vocabulary, but right. it doesn't really feel right. Doesn't doesn't say it. Doesn't. <laughs> yeah. There's obviously going to be kind of natural comparisons, I suppose, to the in-betweeners. Yeah, Even yeah. your character, to be fair, is quite yeah, Simon-esque. Well, yeah. And of course, you've got Ian involved. With Ian is, Ian yeah, Morrison. Ian's obviously one of the co-writers of The In-Betweeners who directed this film. Yes, yeah. But yeah, I mean, I, to be honest, I think I kind of I welcome those comparisons. I mean, it's I, I, I really like Ian. And um, I think, to be fair, there's, there's lots of other really good comedy actors in this film as well. I mean, as you saw Jermaine Clement there, obviously from Flight of the Concords, who's brilliant. Claudia O'Doherty is in it a lot. Um, she, I think there's a little bit of her in the trailer there, but she's she's fantastic. So I think it's like there's a little bit kind of behind the camera in between the stuff and obviously me in it, but then actually there's a lot going on as well. And actually these are like these are great comedy performers. Like if you if you know if you know your comedy, you'll know who these people are and they're brilliant. Yeah. So yeah, there's 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 more to it as well. Uh -huh, of course. And yeah. and um it's ten years actually since it is. It's first yeah. get out, which is absolutely shocking to me. Yeah. It doesn't feel like that. It doesn't. No, no. Um, it's, um, uh, I can't really believe it's been two years. Yeah, I bet I can't. Yeah, yeah. and, uh, yeah, it's, uh, but it's great. You know, I think that's, it obviously, it obviously had a, it connected with people, and that's so rare, and comedy is such a rare it's thing to achieve. because it's real, though, isn't it? I yeah, think so I think so. I think many of those so. moments people will absolutely relate to, as they will do with the festival. I think, I think that's right, actually. And actually, we were talking about Ian there, who, like, directs the festival, and, and I think actually one of the things that's forgotten about, like, about the in-between is, is, like, it was, is how much writing there is in there, like, mm. how, how, um, because it's got this kind of teenage boy vocabulary, it's almost like the writing isn't really there because it's just them kind of bantering. But actually, it's a very, very written show. And I think this this also is a really great piece of writing. The script, when I first read it, I just thought they've totally nailed that. It's a great idea for comedy, a music festival. You, you, you would know the sort of things that are funny about going to a music festival, and I really think they'd... I just really thought they'd nailed it. So, yeah, I think it's a very well-written film as well. Yeah, yeah.